Hi, my name is Signy JD. Welcome back. And sorry, I didn't post a video on Monday, but here's a video right now. Okay, still the week, still the week. You're still getting a video a week. Okay, all right. So today we're going to talk about pitching your song to Spotify editors. Okay, and I will show you. I'll show you the pitches that I did that landed me on the editorial and the strategy that I am using to um, land on these editorials. I think a lot of it is luck. I don't know if some of the pitches really matter as much, but let me show you my approach and how it has gotten me where I was so far, okay? So just to recap the stats, my first editorial was a song called Peace and it landed on the lo-fi garden um this was a while ago so let's see in the since since 2015 so i got 64,000 streams from lo-fi garden okay and it i can't even it wasn't even high up it was like pretty low down so that's how like big these editorials are okay then my second song landed higher seashells it landed on like 20 something or 30 something this summer okay and it landed on lo-fi beats and let's see how many streams did i get from that 261,000 streams okay and then the third one the most recent one which is endless 270,000 streams okay and land on the lo-fi beats players so let's look at these pitches what i did okay so peace let's look at the pitch i said peace this song is about achieving peace during a time of trauma it is a blend of guitar and vocal melodies medleys to create a beautiful track i plan to promote it by using facebook ads and tiktok marketing i don't think this is that great of a pitch however it still landed here uh, here's why i think it landed besides someone liked it short and sweet what's the song about it's about x right achieving peace what does it contain it contains a blend of guitar and vocal med medleys okay how do you plan to promote it facebook ads and tiktok marketing the three main pillars right that's all i did second pitch um seashells i said seashells seashells was inspired by the sounds of the ocean and nature it combines beautiful nostalgic guitar chords with signature D's smooth vocal lines to create a beautiful lo-fi soundscape. My promotional strategy includes Facebook, Instagram ads, and social media organic marketing. Okay, so a little more, but once again, name of the song, what inspired it. Try your best to describe what it sounds like. I think it's a beautiful, it has beautiful nostalgic guitar chords, right? Um, I speak in a third person, um i just chose to <laughs> i don't know if there's any science behind it um and then blah 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 blah. endless okay which is the biggest one so far oh another song also landed but whatever endless right Endless was inspired by the sounds of waterfalls it combines beautiful nostalgic guitar chords with sing to these smooth vocal lines blah 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 i copy and pasted this exact thing because the song is very similar okay I go into more detail. I say these guitar chords repeat themselves, representative of the representative of the endless journey of life. Song is similar to a previous release, Seashells, which was added to the official Spotify Lo-Fi Beats playlist. I think that this pitch, I got number seven on the Lo-Fi Beats playlist um, after I wrote this pitch. So I think the trick is once you get on to a spotify editorial the next song that you make if it's similar in any way make sure you say that like make sure you tell them this is similar you liked this before you added something like this you know in my opinion i don't know though i'm not jesus christ but you know oh well that's what worked for me so far okay another song landed on an editorial called dreamscape um i made the one i made the last video about um oh whoop 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 that's a little vulnerable let's not let's not look at that um 
So my label pitched Dreamscape for me. I told them what the song was about. They took that information and the way they crafted the pitch, they said like singing to these and artists hailing from Trinidad and Tobago with X amount of streams. So immediately within the first sentence, they tell me how many streams they have. I have, I mean, then they say, um, this song is about blah, 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 blah. He has been supported on multiple editorial releases in the past and this song would be perfect for blah, blah, blah. Oh, one of the key things, make it as easy as possible for the editorial when you pitch in. So let's say seashells, um, write this pitch. The one thing that I forgot to copy and paste when I make this pitch is this, this song would fit perfectly in the Spotify, ah, Spotify official lo-fi beats playlist. Or let's say it was like a rap song. It would fit perfectly in the official rap caviar playlist. Okay. Like make it as easy for them as possible to place your song. You say where you want your song to go and hopefully they listen, you know, dreamscape. We didn't say we wanted it in focus flow, um, which is the, um, editorial it landed in. Let's see. Yeah. Focus flow. We didn't say that, but they, they put it in. So yeah. Um, but I think that's a strategy making it as easy as possible them to put so now we're gonna put we're gonna pitch a song together okay okay i have an ep coming out in october um let's pitch eventually it will okay okay i'm not in orlando right now but let's just say i'm in orlando okay um three genres i know this is lo-fi lo-fi beats lo-fi hip-hop okay two music cultures none of these fit okay chill always chill you know the signature d we always chill um hmm. i could say uh i could say a little romantic you know a little mm -hmm. kind of happy it, it must be chill though so um um to be safe i'll just say chill maybe a little romantic Mm, song styles um i don't think any of these fit what does it contain electric guitar that's all i'll fill out for this is it a cover no is it a remix no was it recorded in the studio in my bedroom that's a studio yeah is it an instrumental yes okay here's the gold mine okay so this song is called invented eventually it will is a reminder that in that nothing bad lasts forever this song is part of a larger six song ep called perspective which challenges the listener oh to take a step back and that everything will be okay in the end and that it is not as bad as it seems okay um the song includes dreamy signature d vocals combined with guitar chops and punchy yet calm drums Signature D has garnered or has gained over two, two million. Yeah. Two million, million streams on Spotify and has been supported on many editorials. This song would fit perfectly under lo-fi. Ah, okay. This song would fit perfectly on a lo-fi beats playlist. The official Spotify. The official Spotify. Spotify 
lo-fi beats players this is the most important part i think saying um where it would land okay giving them options or chill beats yeah whatever we'll, we'll keep it at that okay this is my pitch i'm going to save my pitch um i have like a spreadsheet where i save all my pitches because i always want to look back at them and see what works what doesn't work you know so eventually it will is a reminder that nothing bad lasts forever this song is part of a larger six song ep called perspective which challenges the listener to take a step back and realize that everything will be okay in the end and that it is not as bad as it seems this song includes dreamy signature d vocals combined with guitar chops and punchy yet calm drums signature d has gained over two million streams on spotify this song would fit perfectly on the official spotify low five beats playlist okay that's it notice the date it is september 10th this release is october 25th i'm pitching it right now thank you boom right bam so yeah that's that um that's a pitch that's how i pitch um thank you for watching if you have any questions just leave a question in the comment okay thank you very much see ya